Hello. In this tutorial we will show you what's new in version 2.6 of the PDF Index Generator software. We have added some nice new features in this version, and we will show you the most important ones, in brief. Feature 1. In old versions of the program, when writing the index to a PDF file, it was able to write Latin index terms only, like English, French and Italian languages, but when writing non-Latin index terms to a PDF file, it appeared as gibberish. In this new release, the program can write any index terms of any language to a PDF file. This is a Japanese index that looks fine in the PDF file. As you can see here, even right to left index terms, like Arabic and Hebrew, can now be written just fine to the PDF file. Feature 2. You can now specify the font to use in the program interface for the text field entries, to be able to edit any non-Latin text like Japanese. This can be done from the program settings. Feature 3. The program now supports 4K screens. Many of our customers using monitors with a very high resolution, like a resolution of 3840 by 2160. Such users were having problems using the program, as the program icons and text appeared so tiny for them. Now the program will work just fine for them. Feature 4. In step 3 you will notice a new sidebar, that is added at the left side of the results table. This sidebar will help you view and control the results table, in a much better way than before. You can now increase or decrease the display font of all table cells with simple clicks. You can also increase or decrease the margins of all the table cells to give you a better view for the table. Feature 5. For users who are using the Mac edition of our program, you will notice that the program interface looks much better now. The buttons appear much better with standard sizes. Highlighting and usability of Step 3 results table looks user friendly now. The menu bar on Mac looks better also. An option to set the memory value allocated to the program is now added to the Mac edition to prevent any memory leaks. We have made many fixes for the Mac edition and it now looks much better than the old releases. Finally, the old releases of our program require Java 6 or above to be installed, in order to be able to run our program. But since this version it now requires Java 8 at least, to be able to run our program. We have made this change so we can apply new features to the program, and make it more user friendly. Most operating systems already have Java 8 installed on them, so you don't need to worry about that. Many other features have been added to this new release and you can check all the new features from the program help. The new features are mentioned here in brief, and each point is explained in details in its section in the help guide. We have now mentioned the most important features. Please feel free to contact us if you have suggestions for our program. We value your ideas and we truly consider your comments to create better new user-friendly releases. That's the end of this tutorial. Thank you.